my day at Uganda Airlines starts with me preparing mentally, knowing what I'm going to go through the day. Um, officially at work starts um, 8 o'clock to 5 o'clock, but between 8 and 5. Uh, there are activities that I go through in the office when I come. I need have to know how many flights I have in a day. And after knowing how many flights I have in a day, I, uh, I sit down to see uh, the, the lineup of those flights. And when I do the lineup of the flights, because we work in shifts, and in a shift we are four. So if it is a day that is busy, uh, you could find that there are about four flights this, uh, departing at the same time. So we come and uh, distribute those flights among ourselves. Mm -hmm. Each one of us will have a flight to do. And then we sit down to do the paperwork of that flight. When I talk about the paperwork of that flight is planning that flight. How is that flight going to be? I'm going to look at the fuel that the pilot needs for that flight. I'm looking at the weather that is in that route that the flight is going to go in. I look at the crew arrival at the briefing room where I am going to brief them. So all that I have to coordinate with the drivers that are bringing the crew in. Find out where they are because time is paramount in aviation. And uh, you have a, a schedule for the flight that you're doing and uh, it has to depart on time. So it depends for any on-time departure is paramount on your preparation as a dispatcher. The message I have for them is that aviation is not only a manned field. Anyone can become an aviator and uh, it is doable. There's nothing too hard. If you there where there's a will, there's a way. And if I, I made it, any other lady can make it. All you need to do is to be very determined and don't be intimidated. It's been a male field. Even when I was, I was in school, where only three girls at the time and there were 95 boys and I, I just found my life around me so I guess the ladies out there can be aviators and um, in 1995 when I was in school I was put on newspaper to let ladies out there know that aviation is not only for men any woman can be a pilot any woman can be a dispatcher any woman can be an engineer in aviation. So, it is doable.